So let's just make this a very short intro and just pretend it hasn't been a month since I've uploaded this series, but we are back as Tim Tebow returns to baseball as we are back with another episode of Tim Tebow's Road the Show here on MLB The Show 17. Really quick, I will apologize since it's been like a month since I have uploaded this series. As you guys all know, it's been a very difficult month for me in terms of a bunch of different things, but we are back. I know a lot of you have wanted this series to return, and we're back probably not every single day like I was trying to do so before, but at least three or so times a week. And it's all going to depend on the reception the series gets coming back onto the channel. Like, if we can get a lot of likes and just have a lot of support on today's episode, it's really going to determine how much I actually upload this series onto the channel weekly. So, if you'd like to see the series three or so times a week, make sure to drop a like, because we still have got to get Tim Tebow to the majors. I mean, we've been there by now, but, you know, me being a derp, haven't uploaded the series regularly, so hopefully we can do that in the next couple episodes. Now, I think something happened, and I didn't get to save my training from the last episode, so we're going to begin today's episode with using 476 points. Let's go ahead and use them. Let's get the contact up to 50 each. Can we do that? Actually, we can't. Let's go ahead and just do this, and then upgrade the something else. We'll upgrade Bunny to 51 and apply those training points we're up to a 65 overall plus 27 puts us at a 92 overall going into today's episode so once again i apologize about the delay from last episode to this episode but we're back and make sure to drop a like if you want to see the series multiple times per week but with that said let's go ahead and jump into today's first game of Tim Tebow's return to baseball. So first at bat for Tim Tebow returning to the channel. We're behind in the count. 0 2 be bad to strike out to return on the channel. This all oh, Jesus Christ. It's been a month. It's been a month since I played this game. Give me a break. That, that was probably the worst swing of this whole entire series. Derp. Um. Tebow, why are you not running? Tim Tebow has. <laughs> he. <laughs> He strayed away from his religion and went and got AIDS in the past month when I have not been uploading the series because uh, what the heck was that? First of all, he should have caught that and secondly, he was just walking to the ball. Like look at this. <laughs> what are we doing, Tebow? So luckily they didn't score after that error. Our second at bat of the first game of today's episode. Hopefully we can do better than our first at bat. So first pitch of this one, it's going to be high and we're going to pop it up. Oh, let the comments return. Wouldn't be an RBT Road to the Show episode if we didn't swing at the first pitch. So next at bat, it's a nothing nothing ball game still, so the pitching has been pretty good. Not just me that hasn't hit well today's episode, or the first game of today's episode. This pitch, I gotta stop swinging at the first freaking pitch! Uh oh, is that a bomb? Where's the ball? I have no idea where the ball is. Is that a home run? Oh my god, dude. That's 3-0. I was about to say it's still a nothing nothing ball game, but Devin Marrero, a really good prospect for the Boston Red Sox organization, just puts the Pawtucket Paw Sox, I think, is it the Paw Sox? On top, 3 nothing. So we have some work to do in these last couple innings. So I know exactly what the problem was. I completely forgot that in last episode I hit four home runs in a game by using power swing. This first pitch is going to be low for a ball, so it's going to take me a minute to get back into the groove of things, but we are going to be great the rest of this episode, I promise you guys. So runners on the corners, two outs, bottom of the eight. A, hit, a home run right here ties the ball game up. This pitch is outside, please! Please, I think it's too high. Is it too high? He's at the warning track. Please go over. Please go over. God! As that does it, as we lose this first game of the episode, three to nothing. But trust me, trust me, we're going to be great the next four games of this episode. First at bat in game two of today's episode, looking to rebound after an awful game number one. 0-2 count. This pitch is going to get past the second baseman as we get our first hit of today's episode. Not pretty, but better than anything we did in game number one. So bottom of the third inning, we are up now 1-0. We have runners on first and second base. Time to do some damage for the first time in today's episode. Can we hit a three-run bomb? The pitch is going to be lined into the gap. I'm feeling a triple, baby. I am 100% not feeling a triple anymore. But the runner might come in from first base. No, he's not, but we do get an RBI and advance the runner from first to third, so a one run lead, bottom of the sixth inning, this pitch is gonna be hit way into left center field, and it's gonna get over the fence, baby, our first home run of today's episode, and I do wanna say, ow, 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 something just got in my eye, Oh. Anyways, as my eye is bleeding, I was trying to say, before that at bat, we had a double and single, now we get a home run, so we are a triple shy 
from the cycle. So I'm with the seven, so we have a big lead. If I can potentially stretch a double into a triple, I'm gonna attempt it. This pitch is gonna be inside for a ball. Got the Hawkeye back. It's been a while, it like, took me a game or so to get back used to things, but we're gonna be great, like I said, the rest of today's episode. If we can hit something into the gap right here, man, I'm chugging my way to third base. This pitch is gonna be right down the middle for a freaking god dang double play. Well, there goes the cycle. Well, at least we get the win. Would have much rather got the cycle, but hey, a good game, our first good game back in baseball. We get 50 points as we go three for four, home run and a triple. Can we start this game off with a home run? What a beautiful pitch from the pitcher. Is this a curveball to start off the at bat? Wasn't really necessarily looking for a curveball. So pitch number two of the at bat. It's gonna be inside, and I was really freaking late on the pitch as we just screw up our first chance at game number three. I just want to take this lefty out, man. I absolutely hate hitting against lefties. Bottom of the third inning, still a tie ball game. Two outs. This pitch is going to be lined into right center field, and it is going to get down for an extra base hit. So an extra base hit with two outs, as we might actually have a chance to score our first run of the game. So we do now have a three-run lead. Lefty is still in the game. He's only throwing 71 pitches, but we can do some more damage right here with the solo home run. And that's exactly what we're going to do, baby. An absolute bomb. Oh my god, it stays fair. That had to be over 400 foot. Our first no doubt home run of today's episode as that shows you that not even lefty versus lefty matchup can keep Tim Tebow from hitting bombs out of the god dang ballpark as I'm waiting to see how far that actually was. That had to be at least 400, 521 feet for Tim Tebow. Oh my god, dude! Holy crap! I, 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 the 65 overall Tim Tebow is hit one 521 feet! Oh my god! I, like, I've seen people hit bombs like that when they're like 90 plus overall. I have to watch this replay. And I've seen people hit like 600 foot bombs and the sliders are changing everything. But the sliders, like, I don't even know how to change the sliders in this game for crying out loud. Like, this is a 100 legit 521 foot shot from Tim Tebow, man. I've got to see exactly how far this ball traveled. Because that is absolutely freaking ridiculous, man. So let's see. It, it legitimately goes, it goes over the flag. It legit goes over the flag, dude. Tim Tebow is a freaking goat. He's the goat, 100%. And that goes, it gets past, I, it won't even let me go out any farther. Lands, I, I'm guessing that's a river. Can we hit two 500 plus foot home runs in one episode? No, but we get another single. As we get our second straight win in today's episode, as we hit a 521 foot bomb. So one, two count in our first at bat of our second to last game in today's episode. Runner on first base and one out. Let's be great, get a hit as we strike out for the second time in today's episode. But granted, I think that was a pretty nice pitch as at least we still get one point. Tied ball game trying to make up for that first strikeout. This pitch is going to be lofted into left field. I think it's going to be way too high to get out of here. And it is. So at bat number three, we are now down 2-1. But we can change that and tie this ball game up with one swing of the bat. This pitch is going to be outside for a ball. What the heck is that in center field? Like, it looks like a tree, like, growing through the fence. I have no idea. It's kind of, like, messing up my concentration. I think we got jammed right there, and that ball is going nowhere. Okay, it's a shadow. Is it? I, I, I'm guessing it's a shadow of what? So need to get a rally going right here, as in the top of the eighth inning, we are down by two with one out. A righty still in the ball game. This pitch is a nice little two-seam fastball that catches the corner, but a swing and a miss from Tim Tebow, as there's no longer a tree growing through center field. So now I actually have my concentration on the game. Another off-speed pitch for a strike. I don't think I've struck out twice in one game this whole entire series, so hopefully it doesn't happen right here, because that would be very embarrassing. The next pitch is going to be... So we've split the first four games of today's episode, and let's forget that game ever happened, because that was some trash. So first at-bat of today's final game of Tim Tebow's return onto the channel. Hopefully we can do better than game four, because that was awful. Oh, one count to start this one off. Two outs. This one we're jammed on. I think the catcher's going to be able to make the play right here, and he does. So this game has started off about as bad as you possibly can, as we're losing eight to nothing in the top of the fourth inning. Let's see if we can get something back right here. We get a hit, nothing pretty, but we need base runners at this point. The top of the sixth inning, still down eight to nothing. This pitch is right in the middle. That's going to be a home run, I think. Or is it too high? I think it's going to get out. Please, please, get us on the board, baby. Get us on the board, and it is going to get out of here. Tim Debo's third home run of today's episode. Opposite field shot once again, but nothing too crazy. 
because we're still down by seven, but I'll take the extra points. So potentially our last at-bat of today's episode, top of the eighth inning. We need an absolute miracle to come back in this one. First pitch is going to be inside for a ball. Down 9-1 to one now, runner on first base. A home run would make it a six-run game, which we're still not going to come back from. But hey, one can hope. The pitch is going to be low. We're going to hit the opposite field once again for another base hit. But as always, my teammates probably won't do anything and strike out the next at bat. So yeah, that is going to do it for this final game of today's episode. Kind of sucks. We end up losing three out of five games, but at least we still had a decently productive episode. Had two games where we were awful, and then three games where we did pretty good. So I think we're going to have about 250 points to use, which is not bad for our return. So to end off today's episode, we have a total of 264 points to use. Let's go ahead and bring his contact versus lefties up to 50. Let's go to batting, or let's go to plate discipline. Up that a little bit. Go to fielding for the other of the reaction a little bit because it's trash and also let's upgrade his fielding and let's see if that brings us up to a 66 overall and it doesn't but every point does count and every upgrade does count towards our hopeful call up eventually to the major leagues but guys that is going to do it for today's episode of tim tebow's run the show here on mlb the show 17 if you guys do want to see this on the channel multiple times per week make sure to drop a like and like i said I'm going to take the reception this series gets back, return it onto the channel, and then determine how many times I'm going to upload it based on the reaction this episode gets. But hopefully you did enjoy, though. But that's going to do it. Be sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I will catch you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day. Peace.